number seven. Throws a heater, and it's intercepted. Number 14 rifles this two big horned rams colliding out there. That time, he managed to make the tackle. Yeah, baby. Allen gets open and gets the football for a game there. Watch this again. He is wide open. The defense clearly fell apart on that one. And you can't leave anyone that open in for the touchdown. Touchdown. Play here. Picks up some huge yards, takes it to the outside, then eventually runs out of bounds. Check it out. Nice. Number 14. Lost this one way. <laughs> But you gotta fight through the slump of the land one to get big time on this play, and it works. Makes it a little more exciting to watch, too. Oh, he wasn't accurate on this throw in the game. Number 14, that's it. <laughs> Number 14 throws this on a rope, and it's intercepted. No one in front of him. <laughs> Number 14 lobs this one deep to the end zone and it's caught for the game. It's intercepted. Stop at the 48. One man to beat, no one in front of him. It falls incomplete. Fourth down coming up. Saunders catches at left sideline, and he's looking for room. Five, touchdown! Trying to make the catch right there, but that's only the beginning. Look at him chew up the yardage. They've gone deep a bunch today and are having fairly good luck going at it. Yeah, not spectacular numbers, but they're good enough. And that is going to do it for this one. The Lions come out on top 37 to 31. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying goodbye good until job, next good time. Good okay, see you, though. Yeah, That's all right, all right now. Okay, Dan, thank you very much. And let's welcome all of you back to the studio. I'm Chris Berman here to bring you our ESPN video games post-game wrap-up. The Lions stepped it up for sure, putting up some good numbers. We'll pick up the action midway through the third quarter. Number 14 would find his target on this one. A 23-yard touchdown for the Lions. The Lions take their first lead in the game and are now up by three. The visitors answering right back. The visitors already inside field goal range. Henderson got the carry here and he was able to break through. A one yard touchdown for the visitors. Lions trailing by four. Chambers would come up with the big play to kill a drive because he was able to step in front of a wayward pass for an INT. The Lions again have it. Number 14 let his big old offensive line pave the way on this one. A 19 yard play that set up a Lion touchdown. Lions leading 31 to 28. Porter is reading the quarterback's eyes all the way as he's able to get his hands on this one and pick it off. The Lions on defense, number 14, was in the right place at the right time as his interception was a possible momentum shifter. The visitors, after getting an interception, visitors losing by three. Number seven would drop back and deliver a strike on this one. They tie it up, 31 all. The Lions come right back. Saunders would wind up as the hero in this one, though, as his touchdown reception in OT would be the decider. A 75-yard touchdown for the Lions. And that's where we'll leave this one. Lions squeaked out a win, 37 to 31. Now let's catch up with the player who really ignited his team's offense with his death passing and has earned our Player of the Game award. Number 14 is on the field with our Susie Calvert. Suze? 
Thank you, Chris. You showed your mettle, and you edged them out in a hard-fought game. What gave you guys the edge today? Our defensive guys were just animals tonight. They were all over the place, and I think they got on their heels a bit. They made things a lot easier for us on the offensive end, for sure. Chris, back to you. 